Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Kanisha. If you're new here, go ahead, hit the subscribe button, give me a like, and comment your website down below. I'm trying to get to 25k, so help your girl out, okay? As you guys know, I do do-it-yourself videos. And today's video, I am going to be showing you guys different ways to package your Valentine's Day orders. This is my third video this year. So I've done two and I'll have those linked down below. So make sure you guys check out the description box and go watch those. I went to Dollar Tree. Y'all know I love Dollar Tree. So I went to Dollar Tree and I picked up some things. Some of this stuff on here you guys probably already seen if you guys keep up with my videos because I've already had it. I've just been reusing some things. I went to Dollar Tree and got some more items and then I also went to Walmart. So if you don't have a Dollar Tree by you, girl, I got Walmart too. And yeah, some of this stuff is from my last lip gloss packaging video. And I'll have that link down below as well. Y'all love that video. I always see you guys recreating my do-it-yourself projects for your packaging and stuff on Instagram. So that's really, really cool to see. Make sure you guys tag me if you guys use one of my ideas because I would love to see. I love when y'all message me, email me, tag me and stuff. It just literally makes my whole day. So now we have this craft bottle. I'm just going to take it out the package. It is plastic y'all it's not glass or nothing so it's perfectly fine now you do want to watch this if you guys do use this idea because uh you're it might weigh more than what you're used to let's have like labels logo stickers you know make sure you guys add those just to have your brand somewhere i ran out and my cricket machine is acting crazy so i'm just gonna skip that step but y'all get the gist if you watch my videos then you know that i usually add all of that stuff i have these felt heart stickers i know i want to use and then i also have y'all know these little boxes that i made in the last video i think i'm gonna put those in here i think i'm gonna add some liquid lipstick i don't know if i'm gonna put those in boxes yet i have to see how it fits and then I'm going to add um, some lip gloss as well. So that's going to go in there. I may add this beauty blender. I'm not sure. So let's just start with that. Okay, so open it up. Take out some stickers. See what we want to do with them or whatever. Like I said, I wish I had some. Um, I wish I had my logo stickers, but it's okay. This pink scrunchie will look cute. I stuck it in there. Like that. And then I don't know if this gonna fit. Yeah, that's not gonna fit with the um we'll use that for another one. So I'll just add this inside like that. Ooh, that looks pretty. And then just make sure that my logo is showing like on the front because you always want some type of branding, guys. I'm a confetti. You can add this first if you want to, but it doesn't matter. Now let's close it up, see if it fits. Fits perfectly. Let's do one right here. Oh, that looks cute, guys. I love these little felt stickers too from Dollar Tree. They're really cute. Okay, so I added two in there. I may add more, I'm not sure. But which ribbon should I add? I had these three. Which one should I add? I wish I would have got one with like pink and red besides this um, one. I may just do this one because since it has both, but I don't know. Oh, that is pretty. Yeah, let's do this one. I don't know how long I want it. So here is the mason jar. It looks really cute. Y'all can use whatever ribbon, whatever hearts and stuff, but I think this is a cute packaging idea. You can even add a little heart to the top or right here. And this does not even just have to be if you have a business. This is just a cute Valentine's Day, you know, present. You could put some cute stuff in here or whatever. And I just think it looks really, really good. Okay, so now let's move on to the organza bags. And, um... Today, I am just gonna be keeping it very, very simple. This is like if you already have these in stock and you just, you know, you don't have like a huge budget to spend on Valentine's Day stuff and you just wanna make it, you know, spice it up. Okay, so I'm just gonna 
do something really really simple to spice it up so bam there we go all we did was put a simple little freaking felt heart on top and it looks cute like that already thing i like about these felt stickers is the material so it looks like this was made like this honestly like these like really look it looks really really cute okay so you can even add confetti in the inside before you add in the product just to spice it up it looks like this i have a video on how i make the custom um necklace tag so make sure you guys go check that out and then it's tied up like that super cute so simple cheap it comes with a bunch of them so even if you want to have a valentine's day collection and you only have like five dollars to spend you can literally just go get go to dollar tree these bags come with so many in them and you can just spice up your inventory and make it you know valentine's day thing let's move on to the mini gift bags if you guys are only local and you don't have a like website yet you can you know use this packaging for when people like pick up or if you're dropping off or if you have a store or whatever let's cut off the handles on this one well, now this looks like a mini stack and it looks so cute so I'm just going to go ahead and add a few products in here lashes lip gloss and let's do cute little sack in there so we have this like this looks really cute but it's cute don't get me wrong but we want to spice it up so let's just add some cute little valentine's day um heart stickers or whatever let's just add one because i feel like that's cute and it ties in the pink and then let's add in some red hearts you could even stop here or you can keep going and use a plastic little baggie. You can get these anywhere, Walmart, Dollar Tree, and put it inside. I had these since my first do-it-yourself um, lip gloss packaging video, so I've had them for a while. And then that looks really, really cute already. So now let's get some ribbon. we have the bow in there you guys can even add like the sequins and the confetti inside the bag but i think it looks just clean and classy like this so you guys can get definitely get two ways out of using these bags As you guys seen i cut the handles off and then i'm going to show you guys ways to keep the handles on it just looks so cute add a little cute thank you card in here candy scrunchy and then do some lip gloss so we have that and then let's put it like that. You can put this to the side or you can leave it like this. You can bring it down here. But I like the ribbon on here just because it closes it up so you don't have to worry about your products falling out. If you just sell locally and you wanna, you know, give out your products and Valentine's Day packaging. Go ahead and move on to the wedding favor boxes. And we're just gonna use these stickers. I'm getting my freaking money's worth out of these stickers because I don't have anything else to use them for. <laughs> so let's just do one pink one and that looks good. I like that a lot. So let's do the red one right here. And then we have to fold it up. So it looks cute, I love this. So now let's add some sequins at the bottom just because it's super plain and let's add some chocolate this is a valentine's day little card so i made this in my video my last uh video i have it linked down below i just put my brand on it and put a necklace in here and also like cute little valentine's day uh candy and stuff and there we go that simple y'all so if you guys have ribbon, you can even just go ahead and add your ribbon to this. This is so cute.
guys so that is all for this video i really hope that you guys enjoyed it i had a lot of fun making it and i just want to let you guys know that you do not have to spend a lot of money to make your brand really really cute all of my do it yourself projects are always budget friendly so if you guys have any entrepreneur friends or if you're an entrepreneur make sure you guys subscribe comment your website down below or comment some video ideas that y'all want me to do just comment anything it'll really help me out or whatever so if you guys like any of these um ideas let me know down below do you like number one two three four or five i hope you guys enjoyed this video Make sure you guys um, share this video with all of your friends or whatever. If you guys want another do-it-yourself packaging ideas type of video, like this video. That's all you have to do. And once this video gets to 100 likes, I will make another one. So, yeah. Um, like I said, make sure you guys let me know down in the comments which one was your favorite. Literally, this is do-it-yourself packaging for the low. If you got a dollar, if you got $3, $20, whatever you got. I got you. I hope you guys enjoyed. And if you guys haven't checked out my other two, make sure you guys go check those ones out. Let's get this video to a thousand views ASAP. And yeah, thank you guys so much for checking out my channel and supporting me. I'll talk to you guys later, boss friends. Bye.